You're Aries. Welcome to Saturated in Love, where we dive deep into the vibration of love. I hope all is blessed in your world. If you're new, please click subscribe so you don't miss a video, all right? Especially if you like the content here today. Thank you, Holy Spirit, on behalf of the Aries Collective. That's Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. Anybody interested in a personal reading can schedule at the number four, love.info. I want to thank everyone for the five-star reviews on Google. I couldn't do it without all of you. Heart, mind, body, soul, how you're thinking about someone, how they're thinking about you, how you feel in your hearts towards each other. What is the physicality looking like, as well as the soulmate connection at this time? It is a timeless reading, so I hope there's a message in it for you. Anybody looking for membership, aka personal readings for $5 a month, click the join button, all right? I love you guys. Aries, what's the romance angels advice at the center of it all? This could be about you and whoever you're thinking about, past, present, or future. Hero. Energy is fluid. Let's do this. What does Aries need to know? Woo-hoo. And hooey-woo-wee. And ooby-dooby-scooby. poop de dee scoop poop de scoop de whoop shoop de de doop dee That's from Kanye, okay? That's Kanye West. Don't think I'm going crazy. Let's go butterflies harrow and it says enjoy the overwhelming excitement and bliss of new or old love please stop butterflies we're gonna be facing some butterflies okay overwhelming excitement and bliss of new or old love so it could be with your old person it could be with somebody completely new but butterflies okay so aries you're thinking three of wands in a reverse uh, that's energy of not waiting. You're looking at somebody like they're not waiting on you. They're not. It's like maybe they were waiting to see what's up, but this person's maybe moved on. Okay. Uh, they're thinking four wands. They're thinking about you in terms of you wanting to be with them. Four wands is twin flame energy. Eleven, eleven. Um, interesting. So you think Aries that this person is not trying to wait for you or whatever or is it that you're done waiting now they're done waiting they're done waiting because you've arrived because they do see you as wanting this thing okay they see you as seeing eye to eye with them accepting their agreement accepting their terms whether it's friends with benefits it's popping whether it's let's start this relationship it's also popping whether it's let's date and get to know each other they see that you're down okay queen with a crown that be down for whatever okay they see that you're down you see them as not waiting anymore i'm gonna get the tea on that holy spirit what's the tea on the three of wands for dear aries thank you holy spirit chair filled exactly someone new is entering your life Oh, someone new is entering your life, dear Aries. You're not waiting anymore. You see that you found your match. The results are in. Somebody came through for you. Somebody entered your life. Somebody has filled the seat. Butterflies, <laughs> harrow, at your heart space. Woo! Conflict, strife, competition at their heart space. Two of Wands strategically waiting and planning to see what's up, okay? Maybe you fought for this person. Maybe you waited a long time. That was in your head, okay? You waited a long time, but finally this person has come and entered your life. You were so conflicted over not having somebody. You were conflicted over, like, trying to, you know, obtain somebody who maybe had other people showing them love, too much attention, you know, you were like an option for a little bit, you know what I'm saying, with somebody, but they're, I feel like they're honing in their energy, and they're more centered, and they're waiting to see what's up with you too, okay, so you don't need to feel conflicted at your heart anymore about this, let's see, what were you obsessing over, or worried over, what was the jealousy, the competition in your heart over this person, it's like you're jealous over this person, Aries, it's like they can't get close to nobody else, <laughs> Talking, mm -hmm. it says interested, conversing more, awaited message arrives, text, call, email, hovering. They're about to text you, call you, email you. Okay, Aries, claim it by giving this a thumbs up. 
but basically this new person, I feel like it could be an old love too. The new person could be somebody from the past, okay? Heads up, because it says new or old love. Take it as it resonates, but there's butterflies between you and somebody that you felt jealous over, jealous about, okay? You stopped waiting. Three of wands in a reverse. Now's the time. They see you as meeting them right where you guys are. Uh, right now, okay. In their heart, they're they're like, okay, this is the beginning of something, and I'm on, I'm on this road with you, Aries. They want to be here, okay. So you no more strife over who else they might be talking to. That's that's good news. The clock is here. It says need time, takes time, in time, cycles, time to heal, progress. So in your heart, also you needed to heal over your jealousies with this person, okay. In order for you guys to come together and for it to be bliss, you need to simmer down some and know that this person is a stable energy person, okay? Uh, four of wands, two of wands. This person has passion for you, lots of it. It could be an Aries, a Leo, or a Sag that you're dealing with Aries, okay? They have a lot of passion for you, but you need to know that their energy is more focused and centered. Yours was more like, uh, you know, a little intense here, right? A little intense because when you want who you want, you want who you want, but you could be kind of acting out of restless energy where you, when you don't need to be, okay? Because this person's feelings for you are mutual, okay? There are butterflies here. Now, at your body in the flesh, ooh, world in reverse. So you're not feeling like the center of attention here. Perhaps you guys are not intimate yet or perhaps you guys feel as though there's not enough intimacy, okay? Now, for your person, page of swords in the reverse. They stop eyeing the situation with you physically until you simmer down. I feel like somebody needs to know, dear Aries, that you're a stable person and that you're you're not going to like flip out on them. Put it like that. Somebody has removed them their energy from you because they don't want you to keep acting out of character and flipping out and being jealous, okay? So that's that's the message I see here. All right, page of swords in the reverse. This person is not really eyeing you in the flesh like that. Do they think about you? Hell yeah. They know you're their twin flame or whatever the case. They're they're, you know, they're they're happy to like be with you in their head, in their heart. They're they're sure seeing where this love could could lead or whatever. But in the flesh, they're not gonna like come around you until you simmer down some. Quite literally, somebody's like, look, you know, whenever I get with their Aries, their Aries be wilding out, thinking there's other people. <laughs> their Aries needs to simmer down, or I'm 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 pretty much gonna just stay over here. All right, Aries. So do know there is a powerful connection between you and so-and-so and you can feel good at this time. You don't have to worry, okay? But I do see that you're still healing. So in time, this will all make sense. In time, you'll grow more comfortable and more confident in who this person is in your life. At the soul, justice in the reverse. And so because there's butterflies, but maybe not a relationship just yet, okay? No commitment just yet. You feel like you're in balance. There's no justice here because you want your person through and through. You want the whole shebang. The cake and eat it too, whatever, all right? And at their soul, eight of pentacles in the reverse. This person is really not working on a, a, a relationship with you, okay? Again, I feel like this person is intimidated by your energy. Aries, does this make sense? Please let me know. If it makes sense, drop a fire emoji, okay? I do need one more cup of coffee to wake up, okay? So if I made any sense that you need to simmer down a bit or that you be intimidating yours, could you drop me a little fiery emoji? I would appreciate that. But anywho, take it as it resonates. There are butterflies here, but I don't see that anybody's going to be willing to work on a relationship right now until you can trust them more. Until you can trust that, you know, until you can stop showing signs of jealousy and all of that. Okay? I'll do Aries. <laughs> Who am I reading for? Okay. Let's go. Holy Spirit, let's get a Celtic cross for my Aries. What's coming in near future? 
What don't you know about the present situation you might find yourself in today? And the potential final outcome overall here. Thank you, Holy Spirit. This is for dear Aries. So you guys can have your way with who you want only after you secure your own energies not to be too impulsive, not to be overwhelming for someone, okay? Oh, the star. Be wishful, be hopeful, especially with your dear Aquarius. Okay, dear Aries. You guys, there are butterflies here. Also, know where to pour your love and your emotion, Aries. See, the Aquarian of the star card definitely moves strategically where they pour love. They don't just, oh, I love you, and saturate you with love like me who wilds out like a beast because I'm a hype beast. <laughs> I'll say Aries. You know, if my man didn't have his Venus in Cancer, water sign, and if his, can if his rising wasn't in Cancer, water sign, he'd have drowned in my love by now. But see, I'm a Venus in Pisces, water sign. So we just wallow in the waves and we just drown in this sea of love together. And it's beautiful. We love living under the sea. Under the sea, okay? But how, we're, how spirit is showing us now in this reading that you need to move strategically with your king or your queen is to pour that emotion in strategic. So whoever this spread is about for you, whoever you're thinking about, they it's too much. You're too much. Too much too soon. Too much, just too much happening, okay? Sure, they feel for you, but it's like they won't deal with you in the flesh if you keep acting like a hype beast, okay? So pretty much pour intentionally into this person and don't forget to keep some reserves for your damn self, okay? Oh, the Aries. <laughs> what helps or hinders this notion, Lord? We got the star card here. So there's lots of hope for you guys. What helps or hinders this notion? <clears throat> Three of Wands, here goes your Three of Wands, all right? And it's not in the reverse, like it was in your head that, you know, this person's not waiting on me or whatever. Um, now, you know, wait on it, you know what I mean? Uh, wait strategically, okay? See where this can truly lead. Plan, strategize, focus, hone in your energy some. Okay, it's one thing to be a high priestess of fire, right? It's a beautiful thing to be a high priestess of fire. But what does fire do? You could either be lighting up the room, embracing the glow, pro providing the glow and the warmth with your fire or Aries. What else could happen with your fire? Or you could burn out or you could burn someone else out, right? So fire could either burn you out energetically or it could provide light and warmth. So we're going to just need to hone it in some. Oh, that means, okay? So move strategic where you pour your emotion, all right? And your devotion with someone in your life. Then you won't scare them off. Three of wands. A weight results with this person. Unbeknownst to you, nine of wands in the reverse. You don't have to hurt yourself going so hard. What you don't know is that you, you need to pull back your energy some, okay? Because you're hurting yourself trying to prove your worth to someone who already sees your value. Oh, the Aries. <laughs> All right. This person already knows who you are. <laughs> Remember, the butterflies was there equally, but it's like, sis, chill out. Bro, you got this, okay? In the recent past, we have the king of pentacles in the reverse. So again, I feel like a successful relationship, Um, uh, as far as I'm like, uh, uh, you, you might not be engaged right now. Aries, if I'm reading for you, you might not be engaged right now and you might not be married right now, but you need to know that you have the ability to, to have this with your person. Okay. So in the recent past, I don't see that you felt successful in a union at the top of your situation today. We have the eight of swords in the reverse. Very good. So you're coming out of that, those stuck energies. You're coming to the realization of what you need to do with somebody in your life that you care for to make it work. Okay. Okay. You're going to know how to move now. 
in the near future, Six of Pentacles in the reverse. So this is the Six of Pentacles upright is equal give and take. Um, somebody bestowing gifts upon you, yada, yada. So, you know, this means to me, take it easy, take it smooth. In the reverse, you might not have like a, a handout. You know, somebody might not be giving you all the attention that you feel like you need. They might not be giving you any type of... Um, any, any energy, like you, they might not be giving you gifts. They might not be over romanticizing this situation. Even if they have butterflies for you, they might just kind of like seem like they're not trying to cater to you. Okay. Just a heads up again. I feel like it's because you just need to show this person that you're, you're good. Like, like once they see that you're not acting out of crazy energy or you're not overwhelming or whatever, then they're going to want to come back around, you know? It's always like that, especially for dear Aries. Oh, dear Aries. <laughs> um, now let's see what's going on. Jeez, I'm peas and Nazareth. This is how you view yourself. Ace of cups. Of course, we always have the handout like, take my love. My love is here for you. But see how beautiful this ace of cups is because your cup overflows, Aries quite literally. So anybody will be lucky to have you. Anybody who is feeling butterflies for you, they know that they felt those butterflies because you are a special person. They know that you do have a true love offer for them. Okay. So that's why they, that's why you piqued their interest to begin with. Right. So just don't scare nobody off. Let's see how they view you. The emperor. I want to freaking scream. Aries, if you're new to tarot, you are the emperor, okay? Google it. So check it out. They view you as you are. Like I said, this person sees your value. This person does appreciate you. You just need to love, value yourself, appreciate yourself, and know that you don't have to do the things that you do. Say the things that you say. Act out of character. You don't have to think no way about this person. You don't have to feel no way. You just got to be secure and sure of who you are and know that they know who you are. They know exactly who you are. Queen with a crown that be down for whatever. Hey, in this case, king with the crown that be down for whatever. Your person knows who you are. That's why they got the butterflies for you in the first place, okay? <laughs> your hope or your fear. Knight of Cups in the reverse. You fear this person don't come back to love you. You fear you done scared somebody off. You fear somebody else is um talking to yours or whatever. You fear all the other little chicks showing him attention. You fear all those men trying to take out your queen or talk to her at work. Mm-hmm. The after hours drinks crew. Mm-hmm. Who's that colleague? Mm-hmm. <laughs> oh, the Aries. But what is the final outcome? I can't even... Woo! Five of cups in the reverse, okay? Look, if you're feeling a little low, a little sad, Aries, you don't have to. Overall outcome, you're going to be all right. We're going to flip this. Um, I'm sorry. In, in the reverse as is, this is very positive. It means you're no longer going to be sad. You're not going to be disappointed any longer, okay? Not with your actions, not with theirs. Everything is going to work out. The key here is to do like an Aquarius, move strategic, pour only the emotion where it needs to be poured at what the, at the proper time it needs to be poured in. Okay. We don't want to oversaturate, over inundate anybody with our love, albeit wonderful and overflowing. Not everybody is prepared for this realness, right? But they know who you are and that's why they're attracted to you, Aries. So just be confident in yourself. All right. I love you guys. Let's get a... Uh, what is it? What is it? What is it? Lover's Oracle advice here for dear Aries. I thank you, Holy Spirit. I hope this made sense for you. I hope you guys check out membership for just $5. You get your personal readings with me. I do love you all. This is for dear Aries. It says, embrace. Through each other, you find the missing pieces. There's somebody you need to hold on to, Aries. Don't scare them away. And be blessed. Peace.